Let's get to the hard one. The Fresno State women taking on New Mexico at the pit. The Bulldogs came in riding a nine game winning streak and perfect in Mountain West play. They once again found themselves trailing in the fourth, but were able to close out the game on a 10-0 run. They had four players finish in double figures. Maddie Udy with a double-double, 14 points, 12 boards, while freshman Haley Cavender scored a career high 31 points. She also had six assists and five steals. Fresno State wins their 10th straight, 84-78, and improved to a perfect 11 11 and 0 in conference. What about the Bulldog men? They were home today to host New Mexico. The football staff was introduced at halftime now that all assistant coaches have been hired. They saw a great basketball game. Late first half, Jared Hyder with a bounce pass to Nate Grimes, a senior, finishes with a dunk. Grimes had a double-double, 15 points, 13 rebounds. But the Bulldogs were down by 11 at the break. Second half, the Lobos trying to hold on to their lead. Corey Manigault flies in for the dunk. Lobos up nine. That was nice, but same with this. Take a look off the new Williams miss. Anthony Holland gets it to Jordan Campbell and he's going to drive and elevates his way with the left hand. Campbell's only basket of the game, but the crowd loved it and so did his teammate. We we're fighting the whole game. We we're trying to come back from the lead they built. So that really just got us going. He's very athletic and he's tough getting to the basket. So right now he just has to earn more minutes and but he can do that. What you saw. All right, back to the game. The Bulldogs slowly chipping away at the Lobos lead. Jared Hyder with a reverse layup. Then Hyder to Orlando Robinson for the two-handed jam. That cut the lead to one. Robinson led all scores with 20 points. Tied game now, 115 to play. New Williams is going to hit the triple. That puts the Bulldogs up three. So with 22 seconds to go, Lobos still trailing with a chance to tie it up. But this is going to be no good. Rims out. Bulldogs pull the comeback 82-77. Winners of two straight. I was very proud of how we came back and fought and got stops when we needed to. We were on the guys that were shooting. I told my team that we needed to stay together in the first half. We, the, the constant threes really damaged our like morale. So I was, if we stayed together, we'd win the game. 